Steve Mitchell, Shady Cove, Oregon. Oh, not too far away. I love it. And what have we got here, Steve? Uh, this is a 1959 Kencraft. Uh, you call it like a Model 22. That's how mm -hmm. long it is. Uh, uh, park model trailer. So you were saying it's eight feet wide and an extra foot taller. Right. It's about seven feet tall. Yeah. Wow. This thing is incredible. One thing about the Kencrafts, it has a one-piece fiberglass roof system mm -hmm. instead of metal, which was uh, in its day. Kencrafts were only made, I think, from uh, 55 to 75. Okay. Only ah. for 20 years. And they were a subcategory of Kenskill, which were around long. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. I but didn't know that. A little bit of history lesson. Actually, the interior is original when we got it. There, we have done no remodeling other than replace the refrigerator. Refrigerator. Okay. And we replaced the mattress, you know. Um, mm -hmm. Other than that, I just cleaned and uh, just maintained it on the inside. The outside uh, repainted the bottom, which was a red stripe, to go this pewter that matched my truck at that time. Okay. And then we did a yellow accent uh, to complement the appliances inside and also comply, uh, meet with the truck, also with the yellow on that one. I bought the Kingcraft back in 2004. Okay. It was in the nickel for sale uh, as a Hunter Special uh, for $1,200. What? Yeah. The gentleman who we bought it from, his grandmother bought it new in the Dalles. She lived in it in the trailer park until she died. And her grandson inherited it. He would take his grandkids, him and his wife, hunting and fishing, you know, in, in Oregon mm -hmm. and Washington, Idaho and Nevada, up into California, and until a point where the grandkids got too big to sleep in here. So they got a bigger trailer. Nobody in the family wanted it. So he put it for sale on the nickel on, on came out one Thursday morning. And I saw it, I called him at 7 o'clock, and by 8 o'clock in the morning, I bought it. <laughs> of course, I'm so glad you did. Oh, yeah. Oh. It, it is stunning. All right, Lil, I'm hearing you. She's, she's trying to get me to take off of work early before and go, go get this trailer. Yeah, sometimes you got to do it. But you got to call early. Yeah, don't, yeah. don't wait till 8 o'clock. I learned the hard way. Yeah. You know, that somebody hasn't already called it. But, yeah. uh, but it was a Hunter Special, which caught my attention because I thought, oh, I can take it to my friend's gold claim. But when I saw the inside, how well it was maintained over the year, it's a family, you know, item. Mm -hmm. uh, it was just, you know, it, it sold me on it. And my wife yeah. wasn't around when I bought it. And when she saw it, she fell in love with it also. You know? Well, you want to give us a walkthrough real quick? Sure. Okay, I'm gonna go in too, but I'll do so yeah. out of the way if I need to. Right. There we go. <laughs> okay, let me show you. I love the freaky tiki shirt. Yeah, <laughs> I got a lot of that stuff. <laughs> so, um, so the, the little dinette set here, um, these are what they call clicker mm -hmm. couches. Uh, you know they, you know they, they'll click and they lay down flat. So this is where I sleep when we do go camping. And this is the original fabric. Oh, original fabric. Yeah, that's uh, crazy. On that yeah, yeah, original flooring. It's nine inch square. Original tile. It's in here, same as the original tile. It's in the bathroom. Uh, of course, it has the pink. Uh, Galvanized steel shower that's only about a 20 mm -hmm. by 20. Yeah, that and pink shower is a show stopper. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's why you see the, the rope and the, the soap on the rope because if you drop the soap, you'd have to get out of the shower to pick it up because <laughs> it's so tiny inside. Yeah. On that part. But, oh, uh, wow. And the original heater and you know, everything. Well, here and all that works. Everything in here itself works. You know, the previous owners had did the had did the wood uh, cover up on the sink right here before us. I actually had, uh, I had, I had the hood redone. I had this redone when I replaced the refrigerator because uh, the old one died. Uh, um, I took the wood panels out, had plexiglass made, and then I had the backside painted yellow, the same color as this, so that way it complements the interior. You did a good. really good job yeah. matching the colors up, yeah. especially over here, like even that, that's, yeah. that's, that's, oh, yeah. that's tough. Yeah. Match the tiles, and the tiles are all original in that part. Uh, I took out the uh, five gallon electric water heater, and I had an Insta-Hot on that mm -hmm. part. Uh, the mirrors you see that are here on the door, and on that one, and even on the back of the closet door, all original with it. Mm -hmm. um, and even the curtain rod here, that was original for separating the front from the back. Yeah, what is that? I'm so used what to seeing nice like birch inside of one of these, and it's, I love the blonde wood. So anyway, so when you see, um, oh, oh, and the wood is lime rub oak, just okay. to let you know. Wow. Uh, this TV stand's original with it from 59, has a latch back there so you can watch this either laying in bed or turn it around so when you're sitting in the dining room area, you can watch television. What? Yeah, yeah. It, it would, can you imagine the size of the TVs back then too? Oh uh, yeah. They and it, it, that it, iron bracket. It was pre-wired for a TV antenna, you know, for a jack outside, but I but I ran cables when we think went you know, other uh, parts we go to, we had cable we can tie into. Yeah. But it has like a little uh, spice rack system here that's built into it. So cute. You know, and that. And, and what's on that one? Well, this is where you keep a little bit canned goods. Oh, because I, I thought that would maybe be the spice yeah. rack, but that's yeah. really nice. Yeah. And the measuring spoons came with the trailer originally in 59. They're Whoa. still here after all these years. Wow. What was the woman's name? Do you know? Uh, 
I want to say, um, I want to say it was Nelly. It was her name back okay. then. Okay. Oh, home, well, good job, Nelly, yeah. for just keeping this place. Well, beautiful. I mean, it was her home. You know, she lived there. You know, and yeah. a lot of people. You know, when they retire and all they have is Social Security, if they have that. All they can afford is have a trailer. You know, living in a trailer park. You know, mm -hmm. that was really, truly the affordable housing of its day. And a few of them are still around here, but like in other uh, jurisdictions, you know, trailer parks are going away yeah. from market rate housing, which people nowadays can't, can't afford. Yeah. But anyway, but if you look in the bathroom back here, you'll see that uh, it has the original toilet, mm -hmm. original sink, uh, the pink shower, and the original, I'll pull out here, original uh, shower curtain, mm -hmm. uh, which has survived all these years. Oh, that's the bit. original shower curtain? Yeah, oh, yeah. the juice is, is fluttering. Yeah. <gasps> Um, yes. So, Duke, you need to come see this. You need to see the... Here, I'll, we'll do the do -si do I'll move out of the way. <laughs> Look at that flooring, too. Wow. Wow, this is all original. Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. This, we Pink can do this. galvanized shower stall from the 50s. Wow, even the handles and everything. That is absolutely wild. And this must be the original mirror because it's pink. I just oh yeah, realized. it was. Yeah, yeah. original. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, on that part. So yeah, it just had a lot of, a lot of nice features. All the lighting fixtures are original. The one there and these two oh, here. I assumed those were new because they're no, this like no. coppery color. Well, well, I mean, I took them off and I and I had oh, them powder coated. Okay. You know, the same color, but I, you know, I, I reconditioned the lights because the wires were a bit frayed. Yeah. You know, but I wanted yeah. to make sure everything. You don't want to burn probably. down. Yeah. Oh yeah. I don't do that. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's so beautiful. Yeah. Oh my goodness, and this, the heater is original? Oh yeah. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. And it Everything looks works. like that table is one of those that not only folds down, but it can also go outside. Well, you can, but and, and it's designed, it, you don't need it for sleeping purposes, but but it folds straight up, so it only takes about that much space. You can you know, take it outside if you like, or have it indoors here and just out of the way whenever you make mm -hmm. down for the bed. So wow. my wife made the curtains, we, uh, we picked up the curtains. What was nice is that she allowed me to have the trailer as being manly mm -hmm. instead of foo-foo like a lot of the trailers are. Yeah. You know, I see it's more feminine, this is more manly. Yeah, you know. we're gonna have some foo foo yeah. in our trailer. Yeah. So, There's gonna be little foo foo. So Lola the bed. Lola wants Lola <laughs> So the the comforter that's on the bed, my uh -huh. grandmother made. That was for me when I was a baby. It's about 70 years old. That's amazing. Um, Looks like a comfy bed. Well, I, I just replaced a mat, and, it, and it's a and it's a foam. It's very very yeah. soft and mm -hmm. soft. What do you know the dimensions? Is it a, is it a yeah, it's full a twin. size? Yeah, it's a twin. It's not a twin. Okay, it's full, full size. Yeah, okay. Full, okay. Full, okay. Yeah. I'm like, uh, I think that's bigger than a yeah, yeah. <laughs> So anyway, and, and when the previous owners for their grandmother, you know, they built the frame. They got they got two drawers underneath the the, the mattress there. Mm -hmm. and they also added this cabinet, which my daughter um, uh, did a design. You look on the back side, you'll see the American flag. I mean, the not American flag, but the United States. Um, on the yeah. back side. Oh, the actual United States. Yeah, she did that for me when we took it out because uh, a couple years ago I took everything out and I TSP'd all the wood and I resealed everything, you know, kicked the luster because, you know, yeah. it does dry up. Yeah. For, for a trailer you this gotta age. keep it going. Yeah, you have to definitely do right. your, your This is absolutely yeah. crazy to be like yeah. so original. Yeah. And this, I, I just, I'm a See them for Mike, see them for Mike all matches here. In fact, yeah. the cutting board, it matches, you know, the, yeah. the countertops, what they did. So they really did a lot of detail back then, you know. Mm -hmm. um, uh, you know, like here is your, for your dish towels, you hang them out. Yeah. You know, little details there. But you know, when you when you get into some of these, we'll say the real true vintage trailers, you'll see that they did a lot of creative things back in the day. Like, see the old old school that had this screen vent here yep. to allow it to any moisture there would, would vent out instead yeah. of today. You know, they don't do that too much anymore. Yeah. Well, well thank you so much. I appreciate your time today. Many time, many time. Glad you appreciate it. You know, a lot of people come here and they're amazed about how much room is they can walk around each yeah. other without you know interfering with them. You know. It's amazing. Uh, yeah. Okay. Thank, well, thank you. you for your time. Yeah. Bossa Nova.